Hey, what's up, YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. Uh, Throne of Liberty has been out for about a week now on global release. I've been no life in it for like the past week. Um, I was supposed to make a lot of videos for you guys, but I've been just so addicted to the grind. So I really want to start making videos uh, because there's not a lot of information out there. Um, some things I don't think players under, uh, understand or know yet that I wanted to share with you today is the Ama toys. So do this now if you're having a hard time getting loot and you would like to get some more loot. Um, if you push your start button or escape if you're on PC, uh, and you go into the Amatoy house, or here, go to your lithograph book, and you'll see this thing called Pal Synergy. And this is actually really important. Um, I wish they told us a little bit more about this. Um, they probably did, and I probably just skipped through it, like probably 80% of us did. <laughs> but uh, with your Pal Synergies, when you collect certain um, pals or Amatoys, uh, you'll get these little passive buffs that will always be active on your character at all times. Uh, so I highly recommend doing this. So if you are someone who is taking your sweet time through the campaign and you don't know what to do next, I would suggest farming your codexes uh, and try to collect as many of these as possible. Um, these actually increases your item chance, your mastery bonus, your abyssal contract token efficiency, the amount of gold you're getting, and it gives you even an XP boost passively, right? So it's really, really, really important that we do this, especially... When it comes to the end game content, when you reach level 50, and you're farming dungeons, you're farming world bosses, and you're just trying to get good desirable loot to either sell in the auction house or to get your gear score up. Hopefully this helps. If this video helped you, please drop a like, uh, subscribe, and leave me a comment. There's a bunch of videos I wanted to make, but this is one is short, sweet, quick to the point. Um, I just really want to get that out there because it's not a lot of information. I don't want to like hog up. All of your time trying to answer a quick question as to is there a way for me to get an xp boost or an item drop chance increase because the item drops are abysmal like it's you're gonna be grinding for a very long time so uh yeah definitely do this now to make the grind uh less miserable that's that is all thank you so much i love you guys see you in the next one